A big jump in temperatures coming our way. Let's head back to Rob for another look at your first alert weather center forecast. Yeah, I've been focusing on the temperatures and how cold they are today, but I know a lot of people are maybe focusing on tomorrow's forecast because the temperatures are going to move up in a big way. Now we do have some single digits across the area. Most of those are north and west of the city. That's where our colder air has been coming from. So we have seen the coldest air in those locations as the winds are out of the north and west. 10 right now, the current temperature for O'Hare, but 12, a popular number from Midway down to Gary Valparaiso and Rensselaer. It feels so much colder because that same wind that has been bringing in the cold air is just making the feels like temperature go down below zero. Five below is the current feels like temperature for O'Hare three below for Laporte, seven below for Kankakee. That will improve if we can raise the temperatures and we can lower the winds. And we are going to do both of those things. But unfortunately, not a lot. We're going to see the temperatures get up into the upper teens by midday. Plenty of sunshine. We're not expecting any precipitation today. Not much in the way of any clouds. You may have a few in northwest Indiana because they're going to come off of the lake thanks to that west or northwest wind. I think we'll see the temperatures hold into the 20s once we get there and then not move a whole lot overnight. So 22, 23 are expected high temperature and then we'll hold right around 20. We may be able to dip a little bit back into the teens overnight, but this southwest wind is going to hold us here. And look at this by midnight. We're up around 20 degrees, 21 or so, according to this model. But watch what happens through six or seven in the morning. We're almost up to 30. We're going to continue to see the temperatures warm up overnight. And the reason, reason why is this wind out of the south or southwest. It's actually going to pick up. It's going to get really breezy overnight. We'll see that wind continue to pick up. It'll become very windy for tomorrow. And we'll see our temperatures get into the mid to upper 40s. It's the direction of the wind that is really controlling our weather pattern. And that 40 something uh, temperature, it's going to still feel a little bit of a bite because we have 30 to 40 mile per hour winds, but it will certainly feel better than the uh, squall, the snow squall that rolled through last night. 19 for tonight. You'll keep the 40s in place for Monday. We'll do some rain showers for Tuesday, a couple of snow chances on Thursday, Friday.